Hey guys, welcome to another video. Today is going to be a little bit of a different format today because I filmed this what I eat in a day video earlier on earlier like a couple days ago and I'm going in to edit this and I realized that I just don't want to do a regular voiceover and I don't want to do like just music so um, I just want to like go over this and show you guys point by point what I eat so I have to like type it in and you guys can actually like hear the little things that I say about the food that I ate today so this was filmed over the course of one day, obviously, and there's like three meals with a couple snacks here and there. So this is actually a school day, and if you guys don't know, I go to college right now. I'm studying to be a registered dietitian. I'm going to the Massachusetts College of Pharmacy and Health Sciences University in Boston, Massachusetts, but I am planning on transferring to another school that is better suited for nutrition and dietetics, which I will let you guys know later on. Right now, I just want to like you know keep it a little hush hush in case it doesn't really happen. Like that would be really embarrassing if I didn't get into it, and I told all of you guys that's where I was going. Uh, yeah, I'm just keeping my fingers crossed right now. Anyway, so basically I'm just saying that this is coming from a college student who goes to class and stuff throughout the course of a day and I just want to show you guys how easy and how healthy and wholesome eating a plant-based diet can be. If I can do it in college, away from home, then I feel like most of you guys can do it also because you're watching this on a laptop on YouTube and stuff like that. However, I do know that there are some exceptions to the rules. Some of you guys just don't fit into that category, but I'm just saying for like most of us, if I can do it, you guys can do it also. So anyway, let's just get into what I ate. So, um, let's see. So the night before, I had made myself overnight oats and I started to really get into it. So for this, I threw some oats into a bowl and then I also put on some um, Bob's Red Mill Muesli, which I really like. It's oil-free and it's just like oats, sunflower seeds, sliced almonds, dried dates, uh, raisins, and I think that's it. But um, I really like it because of the dried dates and raisins. I really love raisins in my oatmeal, so I decided to throw that in together. And then I put the same amount of liquid that I put in for the oats and the muesli, and just a little bit more. And I also added in some chia seeds in there. So I did like half almond milk and half water for the liquid because I want chocolate, but I don't want it too sweet. And then I just covered it and put it in the refrigerator overnight. And in the next morning, it was like, oats but cold but that's what I really wanted because I like oatmeal but then I don't like it in the morning when it's too hot and I think it's perfect so this is what it looked like when I took it out of the fridge and then I chopped some strawberries and threw those right on top and that was my breakfast now for lunch I've literally been having this every single day for the past five days I know I am a creature of habit so it's just a um, a sweet potato salad so what I did was I had baked a bunch of Japanese sweet potatoes the one with the white flesh and the like pinkish purplish skin I baked a bunch of those um, in the beginning of the week and I stored them in my refrigerator and every day I just go in there take a take a sweet potato slice it up into cubes and throw it on um, a bed of greens so right here we have this bed of greens I topped on some chopped organic grape tomatoes and then I chopped up the sweet potato into a bunch of little dice cubes and threw those right on top and then I was sauteing mushrooms um, and the way I do it is just a little bit of water in a pan, put the mushrooms on, let it simmer. The mushrooms release their own liquid and they release a lot of liquid so there's really no need for oil or butter and you just need water and the mushrooms and they have such a great smell and taste. So I sauteed those and put those right on top of the salad and then I mixed together my favorite ever salad dressing which I will link down below and put that on top and mix it all together and that was my lunch and it was like a humongous potato so yeah that was it and um, for a snack I had it was like a snack mix oh I actually have it right here it's this organic superfood mix that has mulberries, goji, berries, coconut, cacao nibs, dried figs. So I had some of those. And then for another snack, I had these snacking rounds, which are so good. So there's me eating one and putting it down. 
And then for dinner, I had a bunch of leftovers. I freaking love leftovers. If you guys haven't noticed from my other what I eat in a day and vlogs, I had some rice. I had some leftover dal from a party that I had went to and they had so much food. So they were like, you guys, please take some food home. And I was like, yeah. And like most of the food was vegan because a lot of the other guests there were also vegan. So that was super cool. So this is just some lentil dal. And this is some like cauliflower, like breaded cauliflower thing. So I heated those up. And then while it was heating up, I just put greens on the bottom of a bowl. And then I put in the bowl my rice, my cauliflower, and the dal. And that was my dinner. And then for dessert, because let's face it, I always have to have dessert. Um, I had a cup of almond chocolate almond milk the same kind of milk that I used for my overnight oats the day before and half of a cliff bar and the only reason why it's half and not the whole thing is because that's all that was left I ate the other half when I was like hungrier a couple days ago before and then I was like well I might as well just finish it now so that is what I had and that's all that I ate today I hope you guys enjoyed this video please let me know if you like this style or not I like watching what I eat in a day videos from people that like talk and I can see their personality and stuff through it so like naturally I'm gonna do the things that I like in those videos in my videos does that make sense anyway yeah that's it but if you guys want to see a different style or if you like this one please let me know your thoughts down below I hope you guys enjoyed like this video if you liked it subscribe if you haven't and I'll see you next time bye